Now we need to get to the developing situation in central Oregon where an out of control fire is threatening more homes. We're talking about the stubborn Millie fire burning in the Three Sisters wilderness just outside of the town of Sisters where hundreds of people have been told to be ready to evacuate at a moment's notice. Reporter Jennifer Dowling joins us now live from Sisters with what she's learned about the firefight. Jennifer. Good afternoon. Well, the big story of the day is smoke. It's hanging heavy in the air here. You can see there's a ridge behind me, but it's hardly visible at all because there's so much smoke. Now, this smoke is causing some breathing problems for many folks in this area. The haze extends all the way to Warm Springs, more than an hour away. We drove through it after coming down from Mount Hood, and the air quality is considered hazardous in Sisters. It's a little lesser in Bend at the unhealthy level, but still some nasty stuff out here. Now, it's not just the Millie fire that's causing this pollution. With the winds coming in from the west, meteorologists on the fire tell us that it's bringing smoke in from fires in southwestern Oregon and also California. So we're getting smacked with the smoke from all over the region. There's also an inversion taking place, keeping a cap on the smoke right over top of us. It's not going anywhere. Now, this fire has been tough to fight. It's burning in an area of steep terrain, which limits the use of bulldozers to create containment lines. And some areas are completely inaccessible and loaded with dry trees and brush. Now, those evacuation levels have been eased a bit from level three to level two, so that's some good news. People are still on standby, though. And we're going to take a tour of this fire over the next couple hours. So I'll be posting some updates for you on Twitter. And then, of course, we'll have updates coming up tonight at four, five, and six. Back to you. All right, good news that those evacuation orders have at least eased up a little bit, but still a nervous time for those people. All right, thank you, Jennifer.